Hi guys, it's me again. Alright, it feels. Now, today, now, I'm going to be doing a quick DVD and PS2 games update. Alright, now, I've already got one DVD and two PS2 games. Oh, and all three of them are from CEX because I just used the last of my birthday money at today. Yeah, well, it's just in case if there is another lockdown coming. Well, hopefully it shouldn't. Oh, and my mum and dad is... Oh, now, actually... My mum just told me that Yeovil is the lowest one that I know. Yeah, it's because there's no coronavirus cases coming whatsoever. But as for Manchester, Liverpool, South Yorkshire, oh yes, and also Wales, well, I do feel a bit sorry to hear that they're in lockdown. But that's right, that's why I don't go there very often. Okay, so I, let's crack on with this update. Start up with this one, and it's... Dustedly and Mudley in their Flying Machines series, the Volume 2. Alright, now you may remember the first volume which I showed you as part of my entire DVD collection back then. I got the second volume of this one, and I reckon this one will be good fun to watch. Spine with the Warner Home Video logo on the bottom, and the back. Oh, and it's got a couple of those episodes like The Swiss Yelps. Uh, there's a uh, slightly loaded movie stuntman, uh, fly by night, there's no fool like a refuel, dog's life. Oh yes, and even some six classic episodes that I've ever seen on VHS tape as a kid, like Sweet Homing Pigeon, Vacation Trip Trap, Stop Witch Pigeon, Ceiling Zero Zero, Who's Who, and Operation Bird Bray. Oh, and it's got some delightfully dastardly extras like animation veterans commentary on episode 5, which is on Sweet Stop Witch Pigeon. And there's dastardly and mudly spin offs. What wacky races? What? Well, although it should have been said, what wacky races? What? Yeah, it's just a figure of speech, really. But that's why I've already got rid of dastardly and mudly videotape from earlier. And here is a disc for. Dastardly and Mudley in their Flying Machines Volume 2. And the next one is Tomb Raider Legend. Oh, this is for the PS2, by the way. Spy and the back. And here's a disc for Tomb Raider Legend. Oh, well, there's no instruction manual on here, by the way. Right, and the last one, oh, and for is. You may remember um, Sonic Riders game, which I showed you from <coughs> from my PS2 collection, which I showed you last time. Well, here it is. This is the only game that I do, haven't actually played before, but have tested it earlier. And this is Sonic Riders Zero Gravity. Now, I heard that, um, that you can actually use those surfboards um, to make it look like a zero gravity. So that was way before Mario Kart 8 was invented. Spy and the back, and it says shift into zero gravity. And here's a disc for Sonic Riders Zero Gravity. And there's the instruction manual this time. Oh, and it was created by Zagor. So there you go, viewers. That's pretty much all I can show you in this quick update. Okay, well, I better say goodbye now, viewers. And hopefully, I'll see you hopefully again soon. And until then, bye for now.